welcome back to the channel guys welcome back to the another video and in this video i'm going to talk about ios 26.1 also i'm going to see your comments and i'm going to answer them now before looking at your comments one thing most of the people are asking me about like when the ios 26.1 will come out because most of the people are using ios 26.0.1 which is not that good update we were supposed to get ios 26.0.2 but that update got cancelled i think that is cancelled because so far we don't have any you know news regarding that as we are already on 26.1 rc update over here i am using 26.1 rc update from almost a few days now um if i talk about that when we can expect 26.1 definitely the next week we are expecting 26.1 my best guess is these two days monday or tuesday where we can get 26.1 for every other iPhone starting iPhone 11 obviously so the people who are still running iOS 26.0.1 they will able to update to 26.1 now importantly 26.1 is actually a good update it's a better update than iOS 26.0.1 I tested out every other beta I tested out the beta 1, beta 2, beta 3, beta 4 and even I'm testing RC right now I can assure you it is a much better update from 26.0.1 on my this device, I am using 26.0.1 and it's a meh update, honestly. Battery life is not that good. Battery draining is over here. And, you know, sometimes while using the device, it, you know, drops battery really quick. But 26.1 RC is such a good update. Performance is amazing. Overall, battery life is also good. Even if I go and show you the maybe some days of the battery life over here, so you can have the idea about how the battery is. Today, I didn't my use phone much. I didn't use my phone much, as you can see. I used just 58% and I got 5 hours and 26 minutes screen on time. Yesterday, I used around 75% and I got 7 hours and 47 minutes screen on time. Now, this is a really good screen on time. You can see I was using most of the apps that consume a lot of battery life like TikTok, Instagram, you know, and things are working nice. Also, the Geekbench scores are also decent. So, 26.1 hopefully is going to fix all of the issues that people have with the 26.0.1. Hopefully, 26.1 will be fixing battery life issues, battery draining issues, and any other issues if you have. So, yeah, stay tuned on this channel for the update. When the update will come out, definitely I will be making a video about regarding this. But, yeah, 26.1 is coming and hopefully it's going to come next week to fix all those issues. Now, it's time to talk about your comments. So, just let me get into that. Okay, so here are your comments. Let's start with the very first one. On my 26.1 video, someone commented that better than iOS 18.7.1. Well, 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 no, there is a big difference. Honestly, you cannot compare iOS 26 with the iOS 18. Both are very different iOS. iOS 26 is such a big update with new liquid glass element and all that. When there are new features, it is obviously they will consume more battery life. So, if you compare battery life of 18 and 26, definitely iOS 18 is a better in terms of battery life. I know there is not going to be a big difference, but you know, against that, there are a lot of new features. So, whenever there is a new complete iOS update, you have to compromise a bit on the battery life against the new features. So, it is very obvious. So, if you only care about the battery life, I will say just stay on the iOS 18. Although 26.1 is also good, uh, honestly, 26.0.1 wasn't that really good. But, you know, if you only, 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 only care about the battery life, iOS 18 is good. If you, you know, want to enjoy the new features and a good, decent battery life, you can switch to the iOS 26.1. That will be coming hopefully next week. Now, there are some comments like the best so far. Definitely is a really good update. Release date, maybe next week. That's what I, you know, talk about. What is your battery health? It's... 100% for now. Why RC for 18.7.2 when there was no RC for 18.7 and even 18.7.1? I okay, this makes sense. Actually, this is gonna be the hopefully the last update for the iOS 18. So maybe Apple just want to try out before pushing the last update. If I talk about iOS 17, 17.7.2 is the last update. No update after that. So maybe 18.7.2 is the last update. So Apple just want to push the RC and see how it works. Happy Halloween. Okay. Is that your... Yeah. That. Yeah. What I can do? I can 
I can't do anything about that, but it is what it is. I was going to say, but what RC is a very slow on iPhone 15 Pro. Okay, that's actually unusual. Um, maybe you are not charging device properly, or I don't know. Give me some details like what battery health you are on and how you are charging your device. You got a baby crying. <laughs> okay, that is, yeah, I need to, you know, get a good mic, honestly. Um, but you know, that's baby was not crying, playing actually. Can we down from iOS 26 to 18.7.2? Um, actually, no. Also, 18.7.2 RC is out, not the official release is out, but also you cannot downgrade for now. Has the wallpaper dip bug? I don't know. I haven't updated to 18.7.2. I am waiting for the public release, so I just want to you know check out the public release and I will you know get you guys know when I will install the 18.7.2. When will iPhone 11 18.7.2 RC will be released? 18.7.2 RC is out. If you want to try out, you can. OTA, yes, it was over the air update. Nothing has arrived here yet. Um, It is out for the public beta tester and develop, uh, do, uh, developer beta testers. If you are not a beta tester, you will not get the update. 17 Pro, Pro Max here. Wanted to see how much battery drain today. At 6 a.m. battery was at 98%, now is um 9 a.m. and only has 78% left. 20% in 3 minutes, brand new iPhone. Um, Yes, there are some issues going on with the iOS 26.0.1. Um, But hopefully 26.1 will fix all those issues. So just wait a couple of days. We are almost here with the 26.1 and that will be fixing um all the issues. First comment pin please. Thank you. I'm gonna like that. I am waiting. Great. What a great news. Yes, obviously. High screen to stuff. Okay. I love iOS 18 as it is. Okay. I was 18 before. Okay, this is a funny comment actually. Um it says I was 18.5 the best battery. Now if you remember when 18.5 came out. It was one of the worst updates. So many issues and all that. Maybe after, if you are still on 18.5 and you are using like it like from months. And maybe it got stable or something like that. But it was a really bad update. If you, you know, if you know, you know. Let me convert this. My iPhone 16 is better now. I had 12 hours and 18 minutes current time. With, so yeah, definitely. 26.1 is RC is actually a better update. Yes, 18.7.2 uh, RC is out. Thank you for mentioning this out. I still haven't gotten the new update on my phone. I was going to say entire system of solution sucks. Battery drained central. Um, Apple sucks 15 years with iPhone. After this phone is paid off, I was switching. This is your choice. But, you know, I can't go to Android honestly. Finally, 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 iOS 24 is here, definitely is here. I will update the switcher to off and install the group. Okay, great. Apple is not so credible. Okay, I guess these are some of your comments. I think there's nothing much to talk about. Let's see these are two comments. 26 was able to was confirmed by the Apple. There might be an update right after before. Yes, it was confirmed by the Apple, but they didn't give the update. And we are already with 26.1 RC is out and expecting... Um, you know, offshore release next week. iOS 26.1, a beta 4 is a good battery, is nice. The only problem is the wallpaper on the home screen doesn't look same as the lock screen looks. Um, but if you restart your phone, it has fixed. Okay, maybe there's a wallpaper bug or something like that that, he, that you encountered, but I haven't faced any sort of bug. But yeah, these are some of your comments that I wanted to include in this video. And yeah, iOS 26.1 is coming very, very soon. Definitely there will be a very much more more videos coming too. That's all from this video. I hope to get you guys in my next video. Until then take care. Peace out.